And last but not least, the electronic nose. Yeah? The dream is that you can make a nose that will smell smells. Yeah? Um, a few years ago, um, about seven, eight years ago, I, saw, I was watching CSI, yeah? And they had this thing called the Z-nose. So, you know, you don't know if these things really exist, you know? You, you, maybe they're just mock-ups, you know, like Star Trek, you know? But, so I, I sought out the, the Z-nose and it actually existed. And I contacted the, uh, the inventor of the Z-nose, yeah? And sent him the kit, the ABCs, yeah? And he put them through the, the Z-nose. The, the Z-nose is actually a GC, but it takes about 30 seconds to do that run around the column. Yeah, and, and what it does is all it does, it doesn't actually detect um, components, but according to when it comes out, it predicts the, the molecular size. Yeah, and it was quite interesting, it was quite interesting, but it doesn't smell, yeah. The other type of electronic nose is the one they use at airports for um, explosives, and ones they use on food processing, conveyor belts, to detect ammonia, yeah? And basically what these have is they have polymer cells. So they have a, like a, a little batch. Of polymer cells. And as the, as the smell goes over, yeah? Each polymer is slightly different, so it absorbs the, the smell differently. So one might be set for acetic acid, one might be set for ammonia, yeah? one might be set for uh, amyl acetate, yeah? and as it sniffs, yeah, the, the polymer swells slightly if it's set, and it sends a signal and says, yes, I found ammonia. Yeah? So ammonia in a fruit means that it's off. So the electronic nose is attached to a little arm, yeah, and the arm pushes the, the apple off of the conveyor belt, yeah. So that's, the other one is in, in airports, like I said, where it's set for certain drugs, uh, either set for drugs or set for explosives. And when they detect those, then it sends off a signal, so yeah. So that you've been handling heliotropic? Yeah. <laughs> Possibly they could set it for that, so it'd be interesting. Yeah. Shall we try it when we go to Germany? Slips <laughs> 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 something in Francois's pocket. But in terms of an electronic nose, yeah. What we would need to, for an electronic nose for, to, to do a perfume is cells set for each raw material, yeah. And that's not yet, it, it's, it's not yet being developed. It doesn't mean that it's not in the process of being developed, but I, I, I think we're still, even, even with exponential growth in, in technology, I think we're still 20 years away from it, yeah, at least.